What's so exciting about a painting of a swan? We are in the Rex Museum, where most foreign visitors walk past this painting without even glancing at it. But if you put a little more time into it, you will discover a painting full of political intrigue. The swan is of course very beautifully painted. Look how detailed the head and its feathers are. But if you look closely, you will see that under the swan the words the rod pensionaris are written. That's Dutch for the then Prime Minister of the country. And at the bottom left, above the dog, the words the enemy of the state are written in Dutch. The eggs to the left that the swan is protecting are labelled Holland. We are probably not looking at an amusing animal fight, but at the Grand Pensionary Johan de Witt, who was the more or less democratically elected leader of the Netherlands around 1650. De Witt was very powerful in the Netherlands, but was constantly threatened by English forces, and at the end of his life the French and the Bishop of Munster also declared war on the Netherlands. To make things worse, De Witt himself was murdered in 1672 by royalist compatriots. The country fell into chaos. You can imagine that this painting is a wonderful symbol of Johann the Witt and his power struggle. Yet it is not likely that painter Jana Selig meant that with this painting. The work dates from about 1650, when Johann had just become leader of the city of Dordrecht. He started as leader of the Netherlands in 1653, and at that time, Janus Seligen was already dead for over a year. We know that the text was placed on the painting around 1750, during the struggle for rehabilitation for Johann de Witt, so it is much more likely that the Republicans of that time wanted to see his death struggle in this painting for themselves. But even though these facts are now on the table, this painting remains an important national heritage for many Dutch people. Thanks for watching and see you again in one of our next videos.